Hello, how to solve for a in this equation 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 divided by 27 to the power of a is equal to 9. Solution. Then from here, we have 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 divided by 27 to the power of a can be written as 3 to the power of 3 to the power of a is equal to 9. Take note of this that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of n to the power of m, this is equal to a to the power of m n. Then this can be written as 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 divided by 3 to the power of 3 multiplied by a. This is 3 a is equal to 9. Also, if you have a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m minus n. This can be written as 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 minus 3a is equal to 9 can be written as 3 square. Now they have the same base, so we have a to the power of 3 minus 3a is equal to 2. Then here we have a to the power of 3 minus 3a minus 2 is equal to 0. Now let's transform this t minus 3a. This minus 3a can be written as minus 4a plus a. We can substitute here. We have a to the power of 3 minus 4a plus a minus 2 is equal to 0. Now here we can factor a out. We have a bracket a square minus 4 plus a minus 2 is equal to 0. Now we have a bracket a square. This minus 4 can be written as minus 2 square plus a minus 2 is equal to 0. If you look at this, this is in the form of perfect square. If you have s square minus y square, this is equal to s plus y bracket x minus y. Then we have a bracket, this can be written as a plus 2 bracket a minus 2 plus a minus 2 is equal to 0. From here, a minus 2 is common. Let's bring it out. We have a minus 2 bracket. If you divide this by this, we have a bracket a plus 2 plus if you divide this by this, we have 1 is equal to 0. Then this is a minus 2 bracket a times a a square plus a multiplied by 2. We have 2a plus 1 is equal to 0. 
There are two cases here. The first case is a minus 2 equal to 0. And the second case is a square plus 2a plus 1 is equal to 0. Then here, from here, a is equal to 2. Let's call this a1. And from here, this is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using factorization method. We have the product P is equal to 1 multiplied by 1. This is equal to 1. Then sum is 1 plus 1. This is equal to 2. Now our equation become a square plus a plus a plus 1 is equal to 0. Here we have a bracket a plus 1 plus this 1 bracket a plus 1 is equal to 0. Now we have a plus 1, a plus 1, we have a plus 1 bracket this a plus 1 is equal to 0. Then there are two cases a plus 1 equal to 0 or second one a plus 1 is equal to 0. And from here a is equal to minus 1. Let's call this a2. And here also a is equal to minus 1. This is a3. You can see that a2 and a3 are equal, which is minus 1, and this is minus 1. Therefore, our final answers are a1 is equal to 2, a2 equal to minus 1, a3 is equal to minus 1. We can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have the given equation 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 divided by 27 to the power of a is equal to 9. When a is equal to 2, We have 3 to the power of 2 to the power of 3 divided by 27. This is 3 to the power of 3 to the power of 2 must be equal to 9. Then we consider this 2 to the power of 3, that is 8. We have 3 to the power of 8 divided by 3 to the power of 3 multiplied by 2 6 must be equal to 9 then this is 3 to the power of 8 minus 6 must be equal to 9 because from here if you have a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n this is equal to a to the power of m minus n Therefore, 3 to the power of 8 minus 6, this is 3 to the power of 2, must be equal to 9. 3 to the power of 2, this is 9, is equal to 9, which is true. Now, let's check when a is equal to minus 1. When a is equal to minus 1, we have 3 to the power of a to the power of 3 divided by 27 to the power of a is equal to 9. And this is 3 to the power of minus 1 to the power of 3 divided by 27. This is 3 to the power of 3 to the power of minus 1 must be equal to 9. Now minus 1 to the power of 3. This is minus 1. We have 
3 to the power of minus 1. Then here is divided by 3 to the power of minus 3 must be equal to 9. Then we have 3 to the power of minus 1. Then minus minus 3 must be equal to 9. This is 3 to the power of minus 1. Minus times minus, that is plus 3 must be equal to 9. We have 3 to the power of minus 1 plus 3, that is 2, must be equal to 9. 3 square, this is 9, is equal to 9, which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.